You can see out west, the European is expecting big snow totals from this system moving through. Now, again, this is high elevation. We're not really seeing low elevation snow with this, but hey, at least it's good for ski season. So why are we seeing this pattern change? Well, as we move forward in time, and you can see right here, we do have this blocking still up over Greenland. This is going to try to move down a little bit to the south and west, and this is going to allow a lot of these cold air troughs moving in down off Alaska to dive down into the west instead of really making their way over the west down into the southeast you can see this blocking is going to be directly over our head here and now suddenly we're in this positive nao instead of this negative nao so it's just really a quick shift i expect this to last somewhere around 10 days before that cold air begins to transfer back to the east towards the end of november into december but in the short term there's a storm system into the west coast there's another one there's another one so the people out there who are sick of this ridging and dry weather will enjoy this this is going to bring like i said snow to the high elevations cooler temperatures for a while and a lot of precipitation although as we get back towards the end of this run like i said the pattern begins to favor the east coast